On any Saturday, you won't see an empty seat at Presidential Barbershop in downtown Cheyenne. Where I grew up, a barbershop wasn't just you come in, sit down, and leave. You know, it was like you came, you sat down, you talked. Angel Maldonado is from Brooklyn, New York. He says Presidential is a place where people can go to build relationships, like a place back home. I'm Puerto Rican. I come from New York, and I bring my Puerto Rican culture and my New York culture here to Cheyenne, so I display it in a bunch of different ways with music, cutting hair, and art. Angel said he looks forward to giving back to the community. He sponsors sports teams or gives back to families in need during the holidays. There's even food on the weekends for clients and staff. According to the Wyoming Census, the state is 92.5% white. So for kids who are of other races and ethnicity, representation matters in everyday life. I'm opening eyes. I'm showing encouragement. I'm showing them a new direction to help them, um, you know, believe. Angel says expanding the shop is about giving people opportunity in the industry and making people feel like family. Presidential as a whole really kind of brings it uh, more than just barbering. I feel like, you know, we have the military base here. we got people coming from everywhere to Wyoming, you know. I, don't, I wouldn't say there's no culture here, but there's not too much, you know. So when these people come from all these other places, they can feel at home when they walk into our shop and uh, feel at home when they're in our chair. Definitely brings like a different, a different vibe. Um, a different type of culture. I feel like a lot of people come in here and say uh, that they've never seen nothing like this, so I feel like that helps a lot. It's been great, you know. Um, I've only been here since July, and um, I've been able to stay busy. Uh, I just like the environment every day, you know. I don't, I don't wake up stressed to come to work. While there have been restrictions in place for COVID-19, presidentials kept busy. They've even had to turn people away. For Wyoming News Now, I'm Kayla Dixon.